Hi everybody, welcome back to Bimar Sarji YouTube channel. Uh, this is uh, from class 9 book OPT Mathematics exercise 8.3 question number 7b. A train traveling in a circular track of 0.75 km of radius at 22 km per hour. Find the angle in degrees through which it turns in 1 minute. Let's start solution. A train is traveling in a circular track. Circular track means it is a circle. Now this train is moving in this way, circular track. Track of 0.75 km of radius. That means this is center. Then this radius is 0.75 km. Therefore we can write here now radius. of circular track r is equal to 0 0.75 kilometer now here is written at 22 22 kilometer per hour this is the speed so we can now write here speed speed is equal to we know the formula speed is equal to distance by time so distance this is given to 22 this is given at 22 so this is 22 kilometer distance and per hour means time is one hour this I have written in simple form one hour This means that in one year, in one hour, in one hour, the distance travel is 22 kilometers. So we can write here the distance traveled is equal to 22 kilometers. So there is written here find the angle in degree through which it turns in one minute. We have to calculate in one minute so we have to change here in one hour is equal to 60 minutes 60 minutes the distance traveled is equal to 22 kilometer no need to divide or multiply here why because one hour is equal to 60 minutes now in one minute in one minute the distance traveled is equal to now we have to divide this 22 by this 60 why because in 60 minutes 22 kilometer then in one minute less so for less we have to divide now this is our kilometer in one hour in one minute in one minute it travels this much kilometer that means this is our arc length that means we can now write here um, uh, we can write here now uh, this uh, therefore the arc therefore arc length arc length L is equal to this is our arc length 22 by 60 kilometer this is our arc length in one minute it travels this much distance so this is our arc length if we join this we will get a theta now this theta we have to find here we, uh, therefore circle angle at the center angle at center theta is equal to what we know We know theta is equal to L by R. So L is equal to this 22 by 60 and R is equal to we have 0 0.75. 0 0.75. This 22 at the numerator and this 60 will come at the numerator. So this is 60 and 0 0.75. When we multiply <laughs> we will not multiply, we will just uh, continue if we want to, ok, we can do this uh, this is our uh, 60 into 0 0.75 0 0.75 so 45 we get here, 45 22 by 45 this is our radian this is our 
rather not degree this is our radian we get the radian now we have to change this into degree therefore now we know that pi radian is equal to 180 degree implies one radian is equal to 180 by this pi and this degree this means this okay that is implies 22 by 45 radian is equal to we have to 22 by 45 and then multiply with 180 by this pi 45 for the 45 for the 180 this means here is 22 into this 4 and this pi means 22 by 7 now this is uh, 22 into 4 and this 7 will go at the numerator and this 22 is at the denominator now this 22 22 cancel we get uh, we will 7 for 28 okay we got here 28 this is equal to 28 degree this is our degree so this is degree degree this all are degree therefore theta is equal to 28 degree find the angle this is the required solutions hope you understood this uh, solutions if you have any doubts in any steps please feel free to comment in the comment box i will try my best to reply your comments in the youtube channel uh, you can uh, see um, a lot of videos uh, solutions of class 9 10 6 7 8 9 12 up to 12th standard there is videos has been uploaded if you feel it uh, useful you can share to your friends so that your friends can get uh, benefit of it see you in the next videos radhe radhe jai shri krishna